Hello and welcome back to another episode of Warhammer 40k Chaos Gate. My name is Saken. Today we're continuing the blind playthrough on the legendary Grandmaster difficulty. We find ourselves in a bit of a pickle. As always, four bloom systems. We can only get one. Uh, we also have hull damage, which isn't great. Um, if we kill nine enemies with rich weapons, we're going to get extra requisition. Of course, that's what we're going to do. And we bring our prime team to the show. We now got the quote-unquote mimic beacon, uh, which is going to be interesting. Plus, we got a teleportation stratagem. So um, let's see how well this is going to go. Without further ado, jump right into it. Brothers, we need to cleanse this filth. Let's go. The bloom is here, Ektar. This is a bustling industrial world. The omens are plain. There is bloom spawn below. They corrupt the minds of the weak and the unworthy. <coughs> Purge the unworthy. All right, two bloom spawn. One right there. And one further behind. Fabulous. Before we do anything... All right, turn down the sound a little bit. <clears throat> Good. So, lots of explosion devices here, but not that many over here. Well, I guess we're going to find out whether or not it's a good idea to move up here. No enemy contact yet, which means we can move all of the three action units at once. Thankfully for us, we do have. Thankfully for us, we do have a, a minus five uh, warp per, uh, per round research, so we're not tucking in the complete twenty-five, but instead only twenty. Oh no! Where did those guys come from? Oh come on, really? They will not see me here. Come at me now. <laughs> they can't see me. Yes, Commander. All right. If this here happens, we got at least one of them down. Sure, why not? <laughs> Nice, nice. Pain. But this should not trigger anything. I was just looking, is there another explodable something somewhere? The answer seems to be no for now. Hail. Yes, Commander. Hmm. Bit disappointing uh, that the guy with the heavy guns or with the long range is so so far away from everyone. Move all the way down to here, could move to here. My blade is I guess Enders needs to solve this conundrum. Gliding through the world. Gliding in. Getting our uh, AP back right away. <clears throat> Interrupting. Ah! Feel Very good. My wrath. Cool, now that that what is, is done. Name? Yes.
We are starting. And I am his Let's see if we can crit. Oh yeah, we can crit. One shot kill. Love it. Good, we're taking their power away. Thanks uh, for being blinded. I like that. Which means all we need to do is move ourselves further. And we're doing that without wasting time. So we're doing it whilst slaying these fools. Unleash me. Confirm a warp standing uh, ready. Uh, confirm a chapter inspiration there. Hmm, I would love to get that, but not yet. Almost, almost dead. I know how we can kill you in one go. Lovely. We slay the darkness. Going in ever deeper. Ranged weapon gone. Another ranged weapon simply gone. Very good. And we're getting ourselves nicely into cover. And you know what? Let's kill him. I have claimed this wretched bloom essence. What is your will? Yeah, that's too little damage. I think what we're going to do instead is we're doing the only sensible thing, which is get the shields up and let them have a couple of shots. I feel very, very safe and secure where we are standing. Stay down. Suppression doesn't mean anything, really. Strong we shall stand. <laughs> okay, it yeah. Their will. Your orders. Kneel. And down. We could go there or your orders. Your orders. Moving out. Or as you come on. Shooting, maybe killing. If not, we're putting out the next shot. Power back. I've claimed the seed. Unleash me. Disable the ranged weapon. I, I like how the game like casually My introduces limb cutting. It's the 41st millennia at the end of the day. Okay, and this 
kills, regains willpower, and we get three AP back, which we are going to use in order to open that door in a second. Slowly but surely getting the hang of things. Sabers. And maybe I can even push in the door. I matter of fact can. And that will give us three additional AP right away. <clears throat> because we're triggering the next pack. Oh. Uh oh. Not so worried about the reinforcements. Advancing. But that silencer and the tree. Ooh. Okay. Well, this is not Praise the not good, Emperor. but equally also not completely unexpected to see problems here. Silencer <clears throat> needs to go. Yeah, a lot of people need to go, so let's do one thing at a time. I think we're taking the explosion. sure is that explosion worth three time units unlikely to be fair cloud of flies long range we need to get closer one way or the other That's, this is not bad That full cover here is a bit of a problem, and yes, we don't have grenades in order to solve the battle. I am here to serve. Standing ready. Can this thing here be stunned? Literally impossible to stun. This looks better. We knocked her down one of our own what is your will? comrades. That's not so clever. With alacrity. Enders has taken a bit of a shot there. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Oh, he's immune to um, to all of those abilities. Okay, fair enough. One, two, three. Four. If we charge it up, <clears throat> it'll kill one and deal a lot of damage. I like it. Get up! Get up! Get up! What is your will? What is your will? Good, you get a free kill over here. Yeah! 
and you get a free kill here. Another one. That means he's back to full. On another chapter. Right there. Good. At your service. Why is that no damage? Where's the full cover coming from? Huh? Huh? What am I missing? Alright, whatever. We're going to go with that. Start hitting the tree. That's a good shot. I think it was even a crit. I tell you what. No, we can't. Uh, we can't have our crit uh, gem. Ah, too bad. Anyways, it needs to work. That uh, without it, gotta make it work. Good hit. Good hit. Okay. I think one crit, two decent uh, hits. Fourteen. Vengeance into nice extra damage. Into the question: Shall we just position ourselves here? Yes, because that is at least half cover, and we get that one down. Fantastic. And then we do have the Hailer uh, skull, which we put here, and that's our mimic beacon. Let me see. What are their weapons? The cursed plague bell isn't great either. But this year at least will give us damage for the next round aka reduces armor Advancing. okay cool. go ahead almost killed themselves by running through the tank Santor One down The My wrath is restored, Anders. Brother. And I think we're just getting some willpower back. No match for the Emperor's Jelly Runner. Push you a little bit further forward. There we go, good damage. Starting to strike. I am here to serve. And we're getting will points back on Anders. There we go. He is silenced, so he cannot uh, work through that.
Firing now. One. Good hit. Is that the crit? No. Yes. Yes, that was a crit. <coughs> This guy has what exactly? A bolter? Oh god. It will be done. Good, we're moving in. <laughs> nice try. Here. Armed and ready. I want to explode that. Your orders? Hmm. My blade is yours. Hold my way. Good, we're disrupting your overwatch. Which we can all agree on is stupid. Four. Zabaz. Couple of hits, no crit though. The Emperor lights our path. Unleash me. How about you? There we go. You command. This should trigger support fire. Even though it only has one point of damage, there are two more coming in. There we go. And that coincidentally is exactly enough for us to kill him. All of that without spending a single bit of power. I start to get the hang of the game. That was a nice combo. Anders just can't wait. He is rushing it. Okay, and in terms of warp, we actually did really well. I think we had just one iteration of uh, warp bloom at this point. Advancing. They are close. We will find them, Commander. Okay, there is nothing behind here, so I can, with a good conscience, move in. My blade is ever ready. Moving now. Your command. Here we go. Rally. Another tree. Fate shall be tested. And another set of reinforcements. Okay. Cool. Strike for the chapter. 
But we have other plans. Okay, well. Moving in. Now jumping in, fabulous. Standing ready. And time to go all out on this guy. One hit. That's fair. Uh, let's start with the medic eye. Um, just in case this doesn't work out, feel free to deal with that skull. Cybolt into support fire. Into yet another Psybolt. Hold strong! Keep your faith! Yes, Commander. Nice little crit would be fantastic. Well, that was a crit. And yeah, let's praise the emperor. Just kill it. have been excised. Surface level bombardment will commence momentarily. Mercy in death. Ooh, that was good. The the teleportation is invaluable. My favorite stratagem. Even though you lose 4 AP, it's so worth it. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. We didn't kill enough with ranged weapons. I totally forgot about that. My bad. Hero's Plate. That's not bad. Blind grenade, nah. Listen, we effed up uh, with the requisition points. Could have had way more. That was not clever. Okay, and for our purgator, Zoe. Return fire could be an option. I like still like the grenade uh, thing, but down here astral aim seems fine as well because um, the way that I read it is if you crit, you can destroy body parts, and she crits quite a bit, so well, that's not bad. More crit damage is good, and there's a 50% chance of uh, regaining uh, AP, which is fantastic. And she has too many uh, will points anyways. So that's really good. <clears throat> if we can uh, if we can crit. The other option here is a lot of grenades, which I am still confident with. More ammo, it's always good. Seems like that's kind of the base idea of the class. And 50% to shoot back. Yeah, I'm not yet sure. I'm not yet sure. If we do have extra auto options for her, that would be good. Is there anything with uh, plus one auto for everything?
No, but she would be able to... Oh, here! Yes! Enduring reflexes. Yes, yes, yes. Well, maybe that is a good build, because uh, that is a second time support fire, which arguably is a good ability. Mental focus, and then we could go into here. That's actually not too bad. This isn't bad either. But... How about we do this? And then next time, more crit damage. And the mental focus, because mental focus effectively means there's a good chance that we're uh, getting a AP back for her. Yeah, that that makes sense. And uh, then once we have this, next up we go here into this and get plus one charge. And then if if we still have points left over, we could go up uh, here. The extra grenades are good. Okay, so we have <clears throat> a lot of healing already. I like when equipped in a war gear slot. This knight's biomancy ability targets at any range. That could be really good. Uh, that unlocks the uh, apoth uh, apothecarian skull. So I generally generally like uh, that. Uh, the um, the bleeding is rivaling uh, the willpower for our for our healing, which is a bit of a problem, um, I must admit. So we could either go for way more willpower, and then uh, you you just don't need it, uh, or hear me out. Complete the other idea. We could go into warp seat biomancy because we do have a weapon for that and then extra movement speed with the extra movement speed it's not that bad to actually move two targets uh, so that'll be fine uh, and I don't know how good the iron arm biomancy is but one stun with melee attacks it's already two turns um, for, for the get-go, that's three willpower. It kind of is another willpower sink. I, I am very much aware of that. But there is, whenever the uh, knight uses biomancy, 50% uh, chance to gain AP, which is great. So it's, uh, that gives them free biomancies and extra stun if we go all the way to here so that would be one level two level and this plus we can get that or we're getting more uh, willpower to uh, to be fair that's an option as well uh, what we would get out of that is a great option to deal stun damage and i don't know how well that works but i can see a world where you are essentially stunning enemies lots thereof <clears throat> And before you're killing them, uh, you can effectively execute. And if that works, you are uh, getting AP back for the entire team. So I don't know if you can uh, pull that off, but with the right uh, power, it might work. I do understand now better why it is three willpower. At the beginning of the game, I didn't but this could be very very strong we could get more healing of course but i think we're fine with uh, with the healing also the servitors are okay for now we're almost always healing for full anyways um we do have nine uh, willpower and we could get more if we're using the incense and we would be at 13 with the staff even more than that so i think willpower uh, we we are okay we're uh, not that often that the apothecary goes out of willpower. 
Uh, this year the server score um, is actually quite okay. Um, I like the idea. But I also like the idea of the stun. So let's try it. And for the time being we're getting uh, this warp speed biomancy because that's two critical damage and movement speed. And then this here would upgrade our own... No, wait. Ah, I see. That's not our speed, but the speed of uh, the target. That's not bad either, because if we put that onto someone, they would crit quite a, uh, quite a lot more. Or harder, not more. And uh, together with our uh, crit stratagem, that would mean yeah harder just way more uh, way more damage and then we go to here next turn and get the surgical adapt and that seems like a good idea that seems like a good idea Disappointing that we could only get one mission, but we're already working on our warp speed. So much so that we are getting faster. There should be a connection from here to here. It's just sad that there isn't. Good, more augmenters, warp uh, drive, 36 days, but it might be worth it. And we need servitors in the next mission reward. It approaches, Commander. Our day of meditation. Oh, nice. What are you on about, Ektar? Stoic contemplation fortifies the soul, Inquisitor. This is a tradition upheld by our previous commander, Agrava... Um, am I hearing you exactly right? Are you proposing to take the day off? Traditions must be upheld. Excellent. I will make the arrangements. <laughs> I love it how she's like, am I hearing you right? Um, are you proposing to take a day off? Good. Extract tour service goal. We got a new uh, school. Um, I'm missing something <clears throat> with the uh, with the research. It can't be. It, it, it's impossible that uh, there's always that, that we can't uh, get any further research. Okay, cool. So, what's the matter? Gotta get this guy here. Grimoire. Okay, cool. And gotta get this guy here. That's another Grimoire. So, say, if I was to fly to here... I would potentially need to do this mission afterwards. Um, for yet another grimoire. Yeah, we're, we're getting only grimoires at this time because I asked in the report to get more grimoires. So yeah, that's what we get. Grimoires everywhere. But this year has highest priority, so I do agree. Nine uh, enemies with ranged weapons. We're going to do it right this time. Inquisitor, the strain on the astropaths makes these communications exorbitant. 
then I do not have time to bandy words over your lack of progress. Purge what? this spawn of chaos soon, or I will reassign the edict elsewhere. And... Okay. Good work. Look, we're upgrading <coughs> weapons. And our war gear, war gear can now come all the way up to level three. Good. Let's continue our travel. Our barracks are looking fine. That improved healing rate is so, so good. We can play with our prime team every single time, which I appreciate a lot. And we're going to do uh, the mission very, very, very soon in the next episode to be precise. <clears throat> this time I'm not <clears throat> messing up to kill enough enemies with ranged weapons. And we're going to reduce the bloom rate here. Matter of fact, we're going to um, completely free the planet of bloom, which is a great start. And then we're clean, uh, cleaning this one. Unfortunately, I don't think, nope, I won't be able to go to there or there, but we will barely make it to there. Cool, no, but we get at least two out of four. Which means here we're going to be at level two, here we're going to be at level three. And that puts this corner into grave danger. Which then again forces me to potentially hover over here. So that uh, this side is okay. But we're going to do that the next time. Thanks a lot for watching uh, this time. As always, uh, stay vigilant, my brothers and uh, look out for the light of the emperor you will find it near the like button i promise you take care bye bye